Finally this evening, the South African rand strengthened in early trading on Tuesday, supported by rising global precious metal prices and its attractiveness for carry trade. Earlier in the day, the rand was trading at 17 rand and 54 cents against the dollar, up 0.4% from Monday's close. Furthermore, ETM analytics noted that increasing domestic bond yields will likely continue to draw portfolio inflows. Meanwhile, gold prices approached a record high of $2,700 per ounce, while platinum rose 1.2% to $1,015.33 per ounce. Additionally, central bank data revealed a 0.7% decline in the leading business cycle indicator for August, revising last month's gains. Portfolio manager Kabila Tula offers insights into the market trends. Mixed Tuesday uh, on the markets today. Uh, one positive is that the currency is, is uh, doing quite well with uh, the rand having strengthened against the US dollar. That's currently trading at around 17 rand 53 cents uh, to the greenback. Now that's on the back of uh, continued strength in the commodity prices. Uh, the gold price has always uh, or has shown a trajectory to remain elevated. Some analysts even calling for $3,000 an ounce. But uh, what has spurred the broader index is the uh, joining of the PGMs or the Platinum Group Metals uh, at this particular point in, in this particular week. We're seeing uh, Platinum trading nicely up. At this particular point, $1,021 an ounce as well. But you're seeing uh, the likes of Sabania up uh, almost 2%, Anglo American Platinum 1.5%, Goldfields up 1%. So the, um, I guess, the positivity is emanating from the commodity prices, whereas the industrials as well as the financials are weighing heavily on the index and the index remaining weaker given uh, their weighting on that particular index, the all share index. So it's important to, to note that um, going into the rest of this week, we'll be watching obviously developments out of uh, the BRIC summit. We're also watching as we go into uh, we're under two weeks now to the US elections. All of those factors are going to have an influence on the markets.